Let me ask you about my Tennessee Volunteers for a minute. In the Sweet 16 for the first time since 2014, they held that uh, number one ranking for around three weeks during the regular season. I, I've seen a lot of people who have picked Tennessee to uh, pick somebody other than Duke to win the tournament. Um, a lot of great senior leaders. I, I Obviously, I'm biased, but I, I love the way that this team plays. Um, because mm-hmm. I believe that they are a, a true team. And during the regular season, I thought that they had a shot um, to win it all. Certainly, I don't think anybody, as you mentioned, has you know three top five picks like Duke does. But you know, there's some NBA players on this roster, and, and there's some guys who can win you ball games more than one, more than just two guys. There's probably three guys that you can count on in crunch time here. Yeah, look, I picked Tennessee to make the Final Four. I think they are uh, they are very good. Uh, it'll be it'll be interesting as they go on because Tennessee's weakness is they don't have the high, high, highs and talent, and they're eventually going to have to face high, high, high end talent. So, you know, the narrative will be like team versus talent, that kind of thing, because they are an excellent college basketball team. And Rick Barnes has done a fantastic job. Rick Barnes historically is not a great NCAA tournament coach. He's 0 for 5 in 8, 9 games, which is just kind of amazing if you sit and think about it. And, uh, you know, some of those demons obviously almost popped up against Iowa the other day. So it'd be interesting. It's, it's an interesting narrative on Tennessee. They've clearly overachieved for who they are. Nobody thought they'd be this good, right? And But if you lose early in the tournament after overachieving, people think you underachieve for the season. It's a funny It's a funny tension in line there that, that, that Barnes is straddling. I give him all kinds of credit. He's done, a, he's done a wonderful job. And it'll be fascinating to see as the matchups become heavyweight matchups how Tennessee matches up. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.